Some highly requested changes were just made to the Halo 3 playlist, so let's not waste any more time and get right into it here. Saying that players will now spawn with an MA-40 assault rifle and a BR-75 battle rifle in all modes. The map Banish Narrows will now have symmetrical power equipment spawns instead of an overshield on one side of base and active camo on the other side. Both sides now have active camo spawns and also multiple performance improvements have been made to the map Sylvanus as aka Guardian. Guys, if you like this news informational videos, make sure to tap that like button. Make sure you subscribe to keep yourself updated with everything going with Halo. But there is one thing we have to still talk about and that is the skill based matchmaking and that is still super thick it feels like especially in the halo 3 plays for some odd reason i've talked about this in the last couple of videos so i won't beat a dead horse on this but this is one of the changes i think a lot of people really want but i think this is probably something that's just gonna be staying with halo for the longest time that whenever you're gonna be playing the halo 3 plays it's gonna be pretty difficult to play now i feel like a lot of these changes were made because of how sweaty the skill based matchmaking is that you need to make it more competitive of a setup to make the gameplay experience feel a little bit better especially with the battle rifles spawns personally i would like to see banded evo as i do feel like it's a better starting weapon than the bannerful but you know nostalgia all that kind of stuff totally agree with it and also balancing out the equipment spawns on narrow so they both have an active camo i think like that's a direct feedback from the experience being overly competitive because the original narrows when it came to the social settings one side did have overshield one side did have active camo to kind of see which dynamic would play out better now former bungie dev actually talked about skill-based matchmaking recently max hoberan the man behind the halo 2's matchmaking experience basically most of the multiplayer experiences that you remember from halo 2 this guy made it and goes in depth about skill-based matchmaking and the impact it has but that requires a whole nother video so make sure to subscribe to keep yourself up to date and i'll catch you on the next one peace out